We're here in the kitchen today with Kim Kringley. He's the chef and owner of Dakota Restaurant. And today we're cooking up a coriander crusted salmon with shrimp and heirloom tomato ceviche. And you're serving this up with an herbed Parmesan merlotan frites. Absolutely. Sounds delicious. So we've got a lot happening today. So how do we get started? Okay. So first of all, I've got some nice jumbo golf shrimp. I'm gonna just put those in a bowl and I also wanna chop some up. And then the, of course, the citrus in the ceviches themselves. This time we're gonna do uh, lemon, lime, and orange. Okay. I've got some beautiful brandy wine and yellow heirloom tomatoes. These colors are just amazing. Yeah, and the flavor is too. I've done some roasted red pepper, and I'm gonna cut that into thin julienne strips, jalapeno peppers. So we're just gonna slice a few of those, and then we're gonna do some Vidalia onion. Okay. And then we just take the Vidalia onion and kind of break them up into the ceviche. The other key ingredient is a cilantro, giving it that light flavor. Fresh squeezed uh, tomato juice. So we're just oh. gonna add a touch of that to it. I'm gonna do a little bit of pepper, mix this up, and then we just wanna let this to kind of marinate a little bit. So moving on to the salmon? The, the, the main part of the whole dish itself. Okay. Fresh fillets of salmon, beautiful. beautiful. I'm gonna season it with a little salt, uh, black pepper. Okay. I'm gonna hit it with just a little bit of olive oil, and then I'm gonna toast it with crushed coriander. You wanna create a nice texture of the coriander uh, to the fish itself. So it almost does form a crust. Absolutely. But it's, it's not using breadcrumbs right. or frying or anything like that. Okay, very cool. And then the important thing is your pan is nice and hot because okay. like I say, you want to kind of get nice crust going okay. on. All right, so next we've got our herb Parmesan Merlotan frites. Absolutely. And these these actually started out as fried, deep fried, but yeah, for the, put, in the kitchen segment. We put the brakes on there. Yeah, so these are baked. These are baked, but they're still great and crispy and delicious. Of course, you know, the Louisiana classic, uh, the Merloton, which we are going to just peel it. We're just gonna cut uh, cut some little fr fries out of okay. it. And it's about an eighth of an inch thick. You need a little bit of that flour dust to make okay. sure that the um, the rest of the breading will stick okay. to it. So a little bit of flour, egg wash, and the then egg our wash. whole Parmesan mix. Mm -hmm. okay. So how long do we bake them for? We're gonna do about 20 minutes, uh, 400 degree oven. Okay. So while the Merloton frites are baking, we're gonna get started on the dipping sauce. And I'm gonna let you take it with the name of this dipping sauce. Okay, it's Pimenton de la Vera aioli. Okay. So in here we've got the nice, got the roasted garlic going on, the smoky paprika, the light mayonnaise. Like I say, it's a classic aioli. Mm -hmm. Just a little twist to it. So there you have it, your full meals right at 350, 400 calories. And it's pretty much just pure protein, heart smart fats, and just the carb equivalent of less than one slice of bread. And I'm so excited because you can find dishes like these on the Eat Fit NOLA menu at the Dakota.